my watermelon split and I don't know why. <laughs> Let me show you, I need some seasoned gardening advice. I just came out to water and found this. Split wide open with an ant having a heyday in there. Look at that. Why did it do this? Luckily, it's the only watermelon that did it, but I can't figure it out. It is at the end of the vine. I mean, I don't know how I would trace it back down. I don't know which bucket it goes to. It's a moon and stars, which I grew last year. <laughs> I got one and it was delicious. Let me show you the rest of them real quick. This is September, first week of September. They're not, they kind of slowed way down in their size, but they're still hanging in there. Got one down there that I set in the bucket just for support. I support as many of them as I can in the bucket. And this one's an odd shape. Look at that. Kind of like a pear. Got another one hiding down there. My bra ones are doing great. That's one of my big ones. Another moon and stars. I think that's a teeny sugar baby. Actually, it's a pretty good size. Another sugar baby over there. So none of them are split. They all look great. Let me see if I can show you a couple more I have down there. Oh, there's another really big moon and stars. I don't know if I can get the camera on it. Right there in that orange bucket. So I need some seasoned gardener help. Just mystified. There's a couple from the same plant. It looks fine, it's not split. So if you could go down in the comment section of the show notes and let me know what you think, I'd really appreciate it. I know they're not overfed. It could be underfed, could be underwatered, overwatered. I don't know. We've had a lot of water lately. Um, so I really appreciate your help. Thanks so much. I'll look for your notes uh, down in the, your comments down on the bottom. Thanks. Bye.